Hey, what's up, guys? Mongoose here, and today we're playing some standard domination on the map Fallen. I'm using the MK14. First time I've used this gun, I've literally just unlocked it this gameplay, so it's completely bare bones, no attachments, no proficiencies on it whatsoever. My perks are Sleight of Hand Pro, Quick Draw Pro, and Marksman Pro, or just Marksman, I think. I'm running the Specialist Strike Package with Tier 1 Assassin. Tier 2 Blind Eye and Tier 3 Scavenger. Just as one thing I've found out with using this gun in the past few games. This gameplay was done today, literally about an hour ago. But uh, although it's more or less a two shot kill or one shot to the head, it chews through ammo, this gun does. So you definitely need a um, scavenger with it. But I've never really run the um, Specialist Strike Package really either. But god, I've had so much fun with it. I really have. So I'm just building up a streak here. I said I've never really used a specialist strike package. And I, I do get the um the super perk, Superman perk, the super soldier. And one thing that threw me off a little bit with it, which I'm not sure if people use it regularly, they find, but when you get the um what's it called? Stalker. Because I'm used to when aiming down the sights moving quite slow and then obviously when you get the specialist you unlock everything. And that threw me off a little bit at first, so me playing around. I am playing quite campy in a way. I'd rather say cautious, but <laughs> I suppose it's still campy. But as soon as I pick up the um, specialist perk, the old perks, I don't know what it's called. I think I pick it up now, at some point now. That's when I decide, you know, oh, I'm going on quite a streak here. Might try for a Moab with this gun. So, stick to my corners, work my way around the map slowly, picking up people one by one as I can. This gameplay is speeded up, as you can tell, because domination games can last a hell of a long time. I think this one was about 14 minutes long or something. So I have sped it up. So again, instead of helping him cap that flag, I'm just I see him, I see him get killed, so now like, I know there's someone here. I managed to just clip him as he went through that door. That was like a lucky shot back through that. So then again, I move. Because I'm not using a silenced weapon, I'm showing up on the map every time I fire. I'm trying to stay completely away from where my teammates are. That way, I'm not going to get stuck in any traffic, and also, I'm going to be more likely where the enemies are. So we can wait all the way up to the other map now. I wasn't playing objectively in this game, which I generally do, but my team were doing really well, as you can see. We were losing at first, but they just they just dominate. So I'm just taking it, being more of a defender, being more of a slayer. We can wait around the map again. Now they appear to be spawning the backside of Adon, so I'll chill around here for a bit. I've got, only got one teammate next to me, so I should be alright. There's a little kill now to where the quick draw comes in massively. Because uh, hip firing with this gun, it, 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 you've just got to be lucky. It's as simple as that. And what I do is you notice there is that first kill. I killed him and then I ran away. Yeah, it's a big old camping bit now. And uh, the reason I do that is because when they, they if they check their kill cam, it looks like I've run away from that spot, whereas I haven't. On their kill cam I have, but by the time the kill cam finishes I'll actually run back. So I don't think it's safe to go back round there when it's not, I'm still waiting for him. So again, they still seem to be spawning here. But I'm not getting enough traffic. I see a guy in there, so uh, see. Try and knife him, but failed. Pick another guy off. I think by now I'm on about 15 kill streak with the gun. I only use my MP9 once to get one kill. This part here is where the sit rep comes in because I didn't actually see the guy at first. I saw if you see on the floor, he throws a bunch of fountain betting. So it glows up red. Or it might have been a um, motion sensor. A portable radar, as it's called in this game. And this gun is so effective from long range and mid range. Short range, you, you want to really try and avoid short range battles with this gun. That's uh, my advice anyway. I'll chill in this spot for a little bit, seeing as I've only got one teammate with me. So there's a good chance. The teammate, the, uh, the enemy team are going to be coming in, and I think they started to come after me because they saw I was on quite a good streak. So I get quite a bit of traffic coming this way now. And this is where you'll see the power of marksmen. Which I'm just chilling in this corner. I know they're coming for me, and there. One name lights up, two names light up. They can't see me. You know I'm there, but they can't see me. So now I'm on an 18 kill streak at this point, I believe. Yeah, unless I pick one more off. No, this is an 18 kill streak. And now I hear it, so I've slowed it down a bit now. I hear a um, enemy stealth bomber coming in. Well, I hear a stealth bomber and I look at the map, it isn't hard. But while I'm looking at the map, I notice that all my team are at the far side of the map, the miles away from me. So, I thought I'll chill here. 
because uh, whoever's using that stealth bomber is going to be going for a multi kill. So I'll be safe here. Six more kills, I've got the Moab sorted, a nice gameplay. Nice gameplay to upload for the first upload of the day as well. And then what do I know? The fucker comes directly for me. And I can't, I can't describe how pissed off I was. Not just because I didn't get the mole, just because the guy that killed me, this geezer here, I can get his name then. I think he finished on his kills anyway. He was at the bottom of the scoreboard. He wasn't playing on any objectives either. I think he was somewhere like 16 kills to 36 deaths or something like that. It was ridiculous. And I, oh, I was streaming now. And then, as always, once you lose your kill streak, everything goes downhill. I don't manage to get on another streak again. I think I end up getting another four or five kills. I think I end four, no, not four, <laughs> 24 or 25 to four. So, I mean, it was an alright game playing in that sense, but it was just that stealth bomber. That support package, really, it's not fair in that sense. It shouldn't be on it. I had everything to counter everything else. I had my assassin to counter all the UAVs and all that. Blast shield to counter the nades, but nothing to counter that bugger coming at me. But it was about my third gameplay today, this, so I was quite happy with it. And this gun, I'm going to be sticking with this gun. I'm loving it at the moment, and I'm loving the um, specialist package as well. So, yeah, just a. Uh, First video of the day, show a nice little streak and show how much the uh, support packages pissed me off today. <laughs> so yeah, thank you all for watching, I've been Zamongoose, be sure to subscribe for more daily content, and yeah, leave a rate and comment, thank you very much, Mongoose out.